So previously, I talked about the um, result of, of substitution mutations, various different results that could happen. Now I'm going to talk about the result of deletion or insertion mutations. Deletions and insertion cause uh, frame shifts and are therefore called frame shift mutations. So all deletions and insertions will be frame shift mutations if they occur within sort of a coding strand of DNA. Uh, frame shift mutations change what we call the reading frame of codons, and we'll sort of talk about what that looks like. And so these are big deals because they affect every single amino acid that follows the point of the insertion or deletion. So if we look at the image on the left here, we can see um, we just have cat, cat, cat over and over and over again as our codons, where the reading frame is C-A-T, 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 going on, etc. Now, a substitution mutation will not change the reading frame. Okay, we'll have C-A-T, G-A-T, C-A-T, 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 and so on. So what we consider a codon has not changed. Uh, we do get some change, one of those substitution mutation options. We could have a missense, nonsense, or silent mutation. Um, but other than that, um, the rest of the protein is the same. However, if you get an insertion or a deletion, we now disrupt the reading frame. So here we are, we've just deleted that T. So now let's look at our codon, C-A-T, C-A-C, A-T-C, 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 A-T-C. So you see how that deletion uh, caused us to, to uh, now have a different consideration for what our set of three codons are. It now moved us one over. Uh, sort of a, a good example of how this can have a huge effect on a protein are these sort of sentences made of three-letter words that represent our codons. So, for example, let's say V is our start codon, sort of like AUG is, and N is our stop codon. So an original might be, the man saw the dog hit the can, and then stop. Uh, an example of point mutation would be the man saw the dot hit the can. So that just changed that one amino acid. Didn't change the rest of the sentence at all. Here's a deletion of a whole um, codon. So a deletion of three whole nucleotides. The man saw the hit the can. So all the other ones haven't changed, but the order has changed a little bit. Here's an insertion of a whole codon, the man saw the fat dog hit the can. Again, changed a little bit, but here's your frame shift mutation where you are now deleting, we deleted the D of dog. So now we have the man saw the O-G-H-I-T-T-E-H-E-C-A-N-E, etc. So notice that it's changed all of these amino acids, and we no longer have the correct stop codon anymore because that was also in our reading frame. So frame shift mutations can cause a lot of damage to the reading frame.